It's me, Arthur. Look who's back. You got guard, dude? Looking up, Bill. Pretty damn good. Glad to hear it. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. I think I'm just gonna go to bed. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary? Yes. I'm...
Hope you ain't looking for gold, partner. I ain't seen so much as a fleck round here. <laughs> hey, give me some goddamn space here, will you? Just curious is all. No need to get rattled. Get away from me, you damn lunatic! I'm going oh!
Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm, I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Uh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about... to be more reasonable. I'm working. <coughs> I'm working as hard.
Whatever do you want? <coughs> Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm... 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 Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. He's not mean, he's firm. He took my money, he owes it back, we gave him time, and now time is up. Now give me my money. Pay the money. All he has to do is say if yes. If you want the money, you'll have to wait. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. How's that dent looking now? You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> Then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Why does my hat always fall off? Where's my hat? <coughs> the trash. Don't be happy, Strauss. I didn't get any money. I beat some innocent dude and I lost my hat. you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. I mean, I got a bronze. Oh, yeah, great.
<laughs> Fine, I guess I'll go get it first. I like it there actually. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke and I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things and I meant them. I suppose, at the time, but I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story, and not an interesting one, but I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them that ran with you and your associates in town and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm just north of Valentine yours Mary Linton <coughs> alright do I go see her babe I'll sleep while you uh think on that You choose. Do I go see her or do I do something else? Alright. She was mean to me. She blew me off and went and got married with some other dude. Alright. Good morning, Arthur. Good morning, Dutch. You okay? Yeah. Just fed up with all the... Mary, I'll go see you.
love you. Are you leaving? I'm about to go see her. I just gotta buy a new hat. <coughs> and I'll go see her. You better not be leaving. Out of the damn way! Hey, eyes where you're walking. You ain't tough, my friend. Just what's your problem? But you know how to look You're it. dead! Oh. Your days are over, you son of a bitch! Dude, he is beating the crap out of me. You had enough? Oh my dude, he is. Yeah, but I ain't having it. Dude, he was Welcome back, sir. Not have a look around. Easy to beat up. Ain't no other outfit beats their prices. white hat. <coughs> I want one like the one that I got from the first guy I ever killed. It was my favorite hat. Those and go then, pretty fast. And then it fell off and I lost it. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I won. Okay. Let me see if I can remember what it kind of looked like. I feel like it was just a pretty pretty generic hat. I just remember it was white. Or maybe it was maybe it was like this. Maybe it was just like this creamy one. I might do this one. Just keep looking. People been talking about a curse in Valentine as long as I can remember. Some reckon this was Indian land once, but I ain't sure. Mm. Let's look at this one. Oh, it might have been this. I think it was this one. Yeah, I like this one. All right. Okay. Ooh, I can get spurs? Uh-oh. <coughs> you like the look of that one, huh? <laughs> These spurs. Eighteen dollars. Oh, that's so much. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I don't need those. Oh, that's right. There was some more stuff I wanted for my horse, actually. Valentine's been a rough kind of town as long as I can remember. Let me get some ammunition. It's all yours. Good doing business with you. Okay. And then let me, uh, you know, I'm going to check the gun store, and then I'll go see her. Scared of what? Can I get you anything else? Look around. What are you scared of, yo? Oh, wait, Miss Usher's? Yeah, but that's why you're watching me, bro. <coughs> Where are the peaches? I want the canned peaches. Come on, quit passing over them. There we go. Appreciate it. Yeah, man. All right. <coughs> Thank you. Yes, yes, but you, you have a phone, and there's locks on the doors. What? Get out of my shot! Ain't no problem to kick your ass. Someone else wants some? You little maggot! You looking for trouble? Hold on! What's the use of this? About time you got beat! God damn it to hell! One more! Alright, who's going to... Who's trying to report me? Uh oh. Oh no. Uh oh, uh oh, the law's right there. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Horse! Oh my god, come here! Oh, 
Wait, my hat! Okay, I forgot I can equip it for my horse. Okay. Whew. Alright, babe, we're here. Disturb you, ma'am. Um, is um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton, a collar for you. You left me, Linton. Hello, Arthur. Thanks, you're kind of fine. Mary. I heard you and your friends was around. I. <clears throat> Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry Good. Yeah. Should have left me. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, well, you, you've been <clears throat> you've been made a widow, and you come here looking for me. Is that it? No, ain't like that. Arthur. Oh, okay. I. Mm -mm. My ugly. family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. You treated well, Jamie's me like trash. joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. Do You're you know the what only you did to person me, bro? he'd listen to. So he threw me away with someone rough. richer. To marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but but I think of you often. Chelonia? A long time ago now. <coughs> begging you, Arthur. <coughs> I'd say let Jamie live Jamie's I don't know. life. And not They're probably gonna make me choose. What should I do? Daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, no. Arthur. Please. Arthur. <coughs> Will you help me? Yeah, they're gonna make me choose. What do I do, babe? I don't I don't particularly want to, but I'm trying to be a a good person for the game, because Arthur is a good person, but you know, this one thing isn't gonna affect much. I still just beat the crap out of some people. I mean she literally let me fall in love with her give her my time, money, and my life and then threw me away because her family didn't like me for somebody richer and now she wants me to save her family. What do you think? Her. Why? Did you listen to everything she did to me? <sighs> Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. <coughs> you already it's not going to make me the immediate worst person I can be. In fact, I wouldn't even lose anything for this. See, I just gained some, but I'm not going to lose anything if I'd said otherwise. She herself said she'd understand. Whatever. Go get her dang brother. Where is that? Is that somewhere I can fast travel? 
close to. No, there ain't nothing out there. Just admiring your horse there. Thanks. Let me see. Can you see me tomorrow? You know, we can epically walk on to Hokkaido yeah. Court. <coughs> Put on the football field. something fierce think you could give me a ride see she's a little too I mean I'm gonna do it but she's a little too uh, suspicious I think she's setting me up I'm gonna get robbed here in a second I'm calling it right now I'm about to get robbed not by her I'm gonna go down the street and there's gonna be some people but uh, I want to kill him anyway so yeah get on yeah sure I'm fine. oh thank you sir thank you I think I'm about to get robbed you know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? Yeah. Oh, if I'm going all the way to Emerald Ranch, maybe not. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that <coughs> horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool. Always complaining. But does he do something about it? man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit? He was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off. But I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. Do it. Peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> My horse's name is Pog. So. Epic Pog. You live at Emerald Ranch then? Yep. For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. Oh, we're getting close now. Yeah, he threw me way off track, but... You know, at least I'll get some epic, uh, good person stuff for this. Yeah, that's it, boy. Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way oh, of thanking thank you. you. <laughs> Appreciate it. <sighs> what a lousy day. Wait, but what'd she give me? Maybe it was these candies. Man, how far off did she put me? Oh, dang it, I literally am probably as far as I was on the other- yeah. I just doubled my time entirely. <coughs> What about good vibes? What? Did I say that? Are you saying that because I'm telling the lady? Good boy. Please don't 
trip. Okay. Oh god, oh god. Oh. Whew. That was oh. That was something. Okay, wait, hold on. I don't trust these guys. Speak to the boy. Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. A path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What you showed up? What path have you? Chosen, sir. I'm still searching, I guess. We are <coughs> all searching. <coughs> Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for? Safety? Safety and meaning? I'm probably doing this wrong. I'm probably supposed to be mean to get him out of here. I'm probably just making him feel better. Ooh, Jamie ugly. knows the truth. But Why of course, face like that? you may speak with him. Yeah, oh, exactly. you know what? That's probably it. I had to be Teachings nice to get so through. Great. What harm can I do? I'm... Oh, no. Uh, no dude. Don't I'm do not that. coming with you, Arthur. Just come and speak with Mary. Then make up your mind. Oh, come on. Leave me alone, Arthur. I'm All right, last, last of time. <laughs> Sorry, Just dude. Stop. Let's talk about this. This is none of your damn business. Oh, it's too far. You get it. They're just using you, telling you what you want to hear. What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? Yeah. Come on, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I don't have to answer to you. I, dude, my horse can't keep up for much longer. I'll kill his horse if I have to. He's going to slow down. For Christ's sakes, Jamie, just hold up a minute. I was doing just fine by myself. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to k kill his horse. Stop running. Come on, you ain't stupid. You can see it. There's not much I can do. This is crazy. 
You're the crazy one. All right, come on, regenerate. Come on. Damn it, we gotta do this the hard way. Yes, we do. seen it either. I didn't say anything spoiler. I haven't done this mission. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Ooh, that was tough. Now calm down. Go see your sister. Okay. Well, can you hear okay. me before it happens? Okay, kid. I Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? If I was on the phone, you would be hearing me and then you'd see it. Can you hear my voice before the video? That doesn't make sense. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know enough about it. Well, one thing I do know, there ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Yeah. Oh, well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia, though, really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut <coughs> up. All Father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. <coughs> You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father? Nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. Thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, well, um... Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry horses or something, but all right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. <laughs> Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and, what was his name, H Hester? 
Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Shut up, right, dude. Well, bye. I like the music in this mission. <coughs> <coughs> Jamie! <coughs> Jamie! Come home, please. You've. Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. Your boy. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. You ain't gonna give me nothing for that? I mean, not to be that guy, but... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I told her no in my other game. <coughs> Or if I told her yes, I never went and started the mission. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Fine. It would be a douche about it after everything. Great. I literally did that for nothing. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but... Somehow, I imagine I shall. <laughs> I love Arthur. He really is a good person. Dude, I ran as fast as I could. Oh, uh, yeah, by talking them into it. I did better instead of being a douche and forcing them. Careful. <coughs> oh, yeah, I was coming here last time and then I made that dude mad and then I. Yeah. Mm, do come in. Well, it's really the catalog you want to look at. It's got everything in here. Uh huh. Go ahead. Never mind, guys. Jeez. I guess I don't have any money. Alright, just kidding. I'll come back later. Yeah, never mind. Worth a shot. Yeah, I don't have any money, dude. Sorry. Thanks. Let's go get drunk. Okay, this guy's not a good person. My family freezed to death in the winter of 72. If I'd known, known about it, you wretches. Little ferret. What's your problem, partner? What the hell are you staring at? Yeah, you with the squinty eyes and the, and the big old head. Do not break your nose. You. you Oh, okay. Oh. 
I wasn't unarmed, he was talking crap about me. Oh my god! Oh my god, baby, such a big dude. You son of a bitch. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna, babe, if I don't shoot him, he's going to kill me. Okay. No, wait, I was gonna be still. I waited just a little bit too long. I was gonna be still. Oh, God. Oh, man. He called my pants lady pants, babe. I had no choice. I had to kill him. Plus, he killed a bunch of Native Americans. Oh god! <laughs> oh god, after all that. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> god. He deserved it though. Actually, drink this time. Oh, is it locked? It's locked because I killed him. Oh, it's oh, it's back open. Oh yeah, nothing happened. Hey, first time, Mister. Just sleep. Leave it, sir. What do you have? Give me some almonds, dude. Give me some of these almonds. Just give me a drink, quick. I know. Whiskey? You're in trouble. Did I ask? Gosh. Hey, but you're the fella that fought Tommy, ain't you? Yes, I am. Oh, man, it was some fight. You boys slugged it out fair and square. <laughs> Except maybe him throwing you through the window like he did. I, uh, <laughs> I don't know if seen him are. since, but he ain't <coughs> there. Down the hatch. But there's no one home. Yes, I know. I beat him senseless. I'm like surprised he's still alive. That's how it goes sometimes. Anyway, cheers to you, mister. I, I'll leave you to your drink. Yeah, thanks. Are you in the mood for some fun? Let me know. No, quit. Uh-oh, mister. Quit asking. I'm not going to solicit you, prostitute. No, it isn't, so leave this me alone. Liquor. I need him to start getting drunk. Hello, good 
Another? You wanna have some fun? Nope. <laughs> that dude just straight told her no. Good health. Arthur, get drunk, my guy. There we go, it's starting to kick in. right now. Alright, I'm done. <laughs> I love the animations. Now that I'm all drunk. Alright, can I play? <laughs> oh god. Hey bro, it's my turn. Get out of the way, I want to play. Oh, it's a cigarette card? Is this guy drunk? You look funny. <laughs> Sorry, bud. <laughs> Sorry, dude. We're both drunk. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Hardly touched. Nobody mad at me for this. Shit, shit, shit. So could, oh, I'm not drunk anymore. Oh, for oh my god, that horse is gonna kick me. Kick me, horse. Kick me. <laughs> call me an idiot or the dude that I beat up an idiot because he was an idiot bro you're right
Alright, let's go hunt it. I wasted a bunch of money on that uh, beer. Where's he at? Oh, I still have a bounty. Uh oh. Can I pay it off at the sheriff's office? Hey, Victor! Can I you? Come over here! What do you want? I'm in a real bind. This fella, he's in a bad way. You gotta help me. I'll pay you. Yeah. Okay, okay, calm down. Where is he? He's inside. Upstairs. Is he gonna be Come huge? Me, is he gonna be this huge dude? <coughs> She's either lying to me or the suit's gonna You've be done enough harm here. Dude, what is my horse doing? Here. <coughs> I feel like she's lying to me. She is. It was yep. me or him, I swear. The hell is this? I gotta clean this room. Can you get rid of him, please? I'll give you all the money I got. Oh. Bastard started feeding on me. Choking me. He was a demon in human. Okay. I must really be losing my mind this time. You know, there's a pig pen not too far. Just dump the body in there and they'll eat him up in no time. Oh. Okay. Don't worry. Fool's just drunk. Oh. He's lying. Horse, get out of the way. You're so annoying. Had me cover up a murder for twelve dollars. Well, at least that's done with, right? Damn straight. This whole town's better off. Trust me. See, I kind of just want to kill her, though. Like for no reason, really. But I won't. What was I doing? <coughs> oh yeah, my bounty. do for you this evening oh you should know one of the working girls oh. just put a knife in a feller oh, upstairs no. in the saloon Hi, not again I didn't these mean women to do are that. insane no 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 I didn't mean to do that alright leave it with me wait can I kill the sheriff no 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 wait no dude stop sheriff stop Sh oh no they might have to knife the sheriff. The sheriff don't do it. Holy, what now? Sheriff, sheriff don't. We got you this time, you bitch. You're coming with me. Care to have some fun? No, no, you would understand. No. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh no. 
I didn't mean to. And I killed the sheriff, didn't I? Oh my god, I killed the sheriff. Horse, move it. Horse, go around. the sheriff. I didn't know I could do that. Oh no. How much was it? I didn't see. Thirty-seven fifty. Oh no. It's okay, babe. Trust me. I've had like three hundred dollar bounties before, but uh, <coughs> for me trying to be the good guy. I'm still not bad, but oh my god, I just killed the sheriff. Yeah, you can tell by the red lines, they do not want me in here. <coughs> oh god. What, what happens now if I try to go to the sheriff's office? Will the deputy be there? In his place? Dude, Pog, get away from that. like report crime I thought it meant like my crime like my bounty my 750 bounty I thought it could be like oh hey I, I beat up that dude can I, can I pay it off I'm the chick and I knew it was going to be a crime against a woman whenever he ran up there and called her the b word I was like oh I, I had no other choice <clears throat> what's happening oh god a lot of gunshots. Uh oh. Yeah, but I can help. That was a pretty good shot. It's really cool how the game works because I've come by these guys several times and it was the dad yelling at the two kids because they didn't know how to build and they were just on that front wall. Hold on, let me, I'll aim at it in a second. <coughs> I've never realized stuff like this. Yeah, just that front wall right there, that was the only thing they had up. And that's really cool that like days have passed and they've, they've progressed more and they have like their own little storyline but like that's not even a mission. There's no like button I click to 
to do this stuff. I just show up on it, but there's like a whole story happening here, just in the world itself. That's really cool. I didn't even know Boy. that. Okay, that's that's really cool. How about this guy? <clears throat> Punch, you punch back. Don't bother pretending different. Hey, as far as I care. You what you doing? Doing? Yeah, exactly. That one fight I didn't do myself. Everybody in town's been talking about it, but he hit me. Watch yourself! And then Pull I did proceed to horns, beat the life out of him, but still, he hit me first. Hey guys, I have to share with you know Jeez. like that song. Good to see you back, sir. Good on you. Get a fresh start. Oh man, that's all my money. I'll send news to New Hanover. Wait, Bye. that's where I am. I thought I was in Valentine. I guess I was, but I guess this whole area is New Hanover. How much can I get for this bounty? 25. Alright, let's go to the sheriff's office now and see what, uh, let's see who's in there. Myself, Mickey, you never learned that fella's name. Now you'll never see him again, and you'll be sad like when your puppy passed because you slept on it. What's your name, mister? Arthur 